Students in the Survey of Forensic Sciences class are learning that crime scenes in reality are different from those on popular TV shows. For the first time, the class has brought in a real crime scene investigation truck and got their hands dirty on a mock crime scene. Used a suspect vehicle uh, and put fingerprints on it and planted it with various things, uh, a handgun, a knife, uh, uh, a McDonald's bag, whatnot. The CSI truck was there because all the equipment that is used at a real crime scene uh, we were able to use. Students received a story of a burglary and then got their hands dirty collecting fingerprints, blood, and other incriminating evidence. My role was a uh, photographer and documentation and I was also uh, placed as the head supervising officer at the crime scene so I was responsible for the systematic search of the entire crime scene by placing certain individuals with certain duties. The experience took information learned in the classroom and put it to use in the field. It's worthwhile to read these cases in the textbook. It's something else to apply that information to an actual case. And these are little things that I think uh, greatly enrich the subject matter in the course. What they normally have in the textbook is just very broad and vague. Because reading it and actually, uh, you know, uh, participating in such an event as that are two different things. Finnegan says the students handled the exercise well and plans to continue using it in the future. This has been Stephanie Carr with the K-State Collegian.